Okay, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create rollover images. This is useful for um, use on buttons. Um, so, first off you need to acquire two images. You can go to websites to get these images such as um, Cool Text, I think a one that I used quite a long time ago. This basically just creates um two two images for use on rollovers for buttons so if you click on um choose button designer this will basically choose give you two images that you'll have to put a rollover image for so um but i've created my own um it's nothing fancy but yeah um go back to the here so what you need to do is open up just a blank page um, and what you're going to do is just save this out in wherever you want and um, if I just insert these buttons here or these images I like can see I've got a button there and then button over is the other way around so that the background being black it's uh, now red and the text changed from red to black um, so how to make these a rollover so if you um, delete these and wherever you want to place it on your page but as you can see we can only place it at the top because it's blank but if we have say a load of other stuff we want to place it in between them that's where you would select but I'm just going to select it at the top go to insert image objects rollover image this will bring up this the image name you can leave it as um, image 1 but I'm just going to put it as button if if the button is for example a button for home or tutorials or contact us um, yeah just put your uh, your put image name and your alternate text down here to whatever your button actually says um, so your original image click on browse go to your first one not your over one click OK and your second rollover image is the button over make sure preload rollover image is set and this will be the link to where it is going to go now I don't want I'm not actually going to put a link in here so I'm just going to put one of these and this makes sure and this this just makes like the button like clickable it just like refreshes sort of thing click OK and there you have it we've got one it looks like one image uh, but it's not so don't be fooled by that so if we save this out and if we go back to here refresh there it is and as you roll over it it changes and as you can see that hash what we put in if you look down at the bottom you've got to sit there it just makes sure that um, the, the the link the image is clickable but it doesn't actually go anywhere when we click it okay so that's how to create a rollover image real simple uh, Dreamweaver makes things very simple for you now so um, yeah enjoy